to Game of Thrones mod, and we are back as the Lord Paramount, John of House Stark, the legitimized bastard by the king that never was. <laughs> but we're just going to uh, keep that little tip of information from the other people of Westeros, because Stannis legitimized us, even though he didn't have the right to. Um, he, by the way, Stannis, that is, is, uh, locked up. Not even by Tom, but by Lord Manfred of Blackhaven. Now, I don't know why he locked him up. Uh, it's great intrigue. <laughs> um, is Dundarian. Now, um, Edric Storm and Shireen's son is the Lord Paramount of the Stormlands. Now, he only has, uh, yeah, and Edric Storm, uh, was married to Sorella Sand. It's kind of crazy. And Marcella had Shireen killed her, uh, cousin. Yep. Well, I guess it really wouldn't be her cousin because, uh, it's not Robert's kid, so. Anyways, until that is debunked, which I think is weird, though, because they all have Lannister, even though they're supposed to be Baratheon, but it doesn't say that they're bastards or anything, so. Why it doesn't, I don't know. But, uh, yeah. We, uh, are Master at Arms. Because it is something John probably would do in the story, especially for a Lannister. But John's a little bit of a lunatic right now, so being stark raving mad, I think he might think that he could uh, do some good in the realm by being on the council. But he does have pretty good traits overall. We have proud, authoritative, we have honorable, brave, just, honest, kind, diligent, and the one. Uh, bad little mark of being lunatic. We do have Wowing Sympathizer, which doesn't give us good, uh, tra uh, what you call it, um, general opinions, minus 10 from the jump. So, last time we left off, we finally beat back the White Walkers with the help of the Iron Throne, and, uh, so we don't have to worry about them anymore. We can, um, go ahead and put our, our realm back together. But as of right now, uh, the only ones that are under the throne right now are us, the Bale, the Stormlands, and the Reach. So, the Trident is at war. Uh, I guess they're going after the Stepstones. Stepstones for emancipation. This, uh, <clears throat> Orland Tully, which is, uh, Edmure's son with, uh, Rosalind. He is incapable. I don't know what happened to him. He must have had an injury somehow. But, uh, yeah. He's pretty much done, though. So, somebody's probably gonna take that over. Uh. And the Westerlands are at war with the Dornish over Bloody Feud. Um. And it's Arion, actually. He's attacking the so, so, Arion is now the, uh, Princess of Dorn. Um, they're under the Seven Kingdoms, are just not, I guess, because they're at war right now, so. But yeah, Cersei's, uh, Cersei the Whisperer, is her name. And Arion's married to some old dude. Oh my god, Sir Ellen Payne is her husband. <laughs> and they've had a kid. Little Prince Trebar. 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 She has a decent amount of men for Dorne. Dorn usually doesn't must have any men. Uh, Cersei has over 16,000. And she married her other cousin, Martin. But uh, she's too old to have kids. Martin, on the other hand, is pretty young. I don't know why I did that. But probably pretty stupid. It's Lancel's brother. And Lancel is also a The Whisperer. <laughs> uh, yeah, so. He's married to Amory Frey, uh, I forget what her nickname was, it was like Backdoor Mary or something like that. 
I forget what it was. She's a whore. That's what it means. Uh, yeah, so... But we have some intriguing things going on right now. We have some factions here. We started an independence faction. Uh, we're going to go by John. John's pretty much called, like, you know, the North behind him. He's still, he's still uh, you know, marinating on the whole, uh, you know, he could claim the Iron Throne. Because Helen Reed has told us that our real parents are. But uh, we're not in any kind of uh, state right now to do that on our own. Now... I was wondering, I was thinking maybe that we should join uh, the faction of Edric for Iron Thunder. But you see, if when we join it, it goes up a whole 110%. <laughs> but the thing is, is right now, we just came out of war. Our vassals are like <laughs> minus 30, some minus 50. Like, we really need to drop that down. That's going to take a minute. But hopefully, with the independence one, if we're leading this, hopefully some other ones will jump in with us, maybe, and that way, since we're leading, we can decide when we want to do our independence. So, we can literally, when we are sufficiently power enough, powerful enough, we can actually go right now, maybe we have over 100, so, I think, let me see, uh... I mean, yeah, I can do it right now. I think I did do it with a hunt. I don't forget what it is, but uh Yeah, we can do it right now. And we can claim the iron third at any time. Just by claiming that third it just doesn't it just makes us a, a so-called traitor. But right now King Tom, but it, the more these heirs that pop up on the like the Baratheons, there are gonna be other people that are gonna not like us. So yeah. That's going to be eight years worth, I think. 160 months, I think that's what that would be. I'm not sure. Um, but yeah. We are going to go at, uh, we're going to stay at our independence one. I don't think we're in the state right now. See, the thing is, we could, uh, I just start with it. We, uh, the Iron Throne only has 21,000. Uh, with us and the reach together, we can do it. But, like I said, we're gonna have to use our men, and that's not gonna fly. <laughs> that White Walker war drug out for so long. And I knew I should have went after him right after the first time we beat him back. The first time was very, you know, it was, it was a struggle because they had a good 30 something thousand men, and we had literally shit. Like, we're thinking about 9,000 men. The only thing that helped us is some of the other uh, lords that came in and helped us. But we need to be more uh, worried about putting our realm back together. So let's get to change this map. I hate something on it. Alright, so we're in the north. We got all our territories back. But with that, we inherited all the ones that the White Walkers had. And a lot of them don't have any houses that are ancestral to those holdings left. There are no car hold there are no car starks. There's one but he's locked up and um I think it's either uh he's either the twins or Red Keep, I can't remember. I think he's at the Red Keep. There he is right there. Harry and Car Stark. He's thirty nine, he has no kids, he has no wife. Uh, everybody in his family, except for Rickard and the two brothers killed by Jamie. Alice Carstar was killed, her thin husband was killed. Even after him, Ned of the Wolfwood was, uh, died of severe stress. <clears throat> so we had a lot of people killed by White Walkers. Um, they really tore us to shit. So, but a couple things happened, so, so... We were able to invite our brother Rick on because he is aged pretty quick. I didn't even realize he was that old. Um, it's kind of stupid though because Willis friggin' gave him a diplomacy education. We should have gave him a martial one. But that's the AI for you to do dumb shit. So, uh, yeah. Hopefully we can um, force training maybe and get him up. Be a little better of a fighter, but uh, 
he's pretty much he's gonna take our uh or said he will take our invite and we're gonna get him married and then we're gonna give him the car we're gonna give him a car hold because i think if there's not a car star uh in charge of that it should be a star since they're pretty much a cadet house star see those little guys in there funny <clears throat> they're like loading them up on the cart to go burn them I always thought that was crazy. I never knew what it was for the longest time. Uh, I never like pan in that close. They're just like carrying, getting on the dead bodies. And some of them you'll see there's like a little fire or burning them. <laughs> but I don't know. I guess that comes next, or I don't know. Maybe that's just for the disease. But yeah, uh, we have all. Well, not all. We have one thing of Skaga, so and we have the ability to create. Um, High Lordship of uh, Skoggers. So we are going to do that and we're going to give it to one of these peeps. I think I'm going to give it to the younger guy. I mean, he has a son. I think this guy's got a son too, doesn't he? Yeah. His son's four. And this guy's son is four. Yeah, we'll give it to the, the younger one. Whoa! I guess that's one of Craster's beauties. She's, uh, still cold, guys. I don't know if I like that. <laughs> yeah, she. That's kind of weird. I don't know if I want to give it to him now. <laughs> I don't know if she, like, possess him or something. But she's a wild wing. I don't know if she's a good guy. See, that's right. They follow the same gods, too. So, uh,. I don't know what would be better to give it to the deep down or Driftwood Hall or <coughs> deep down. They're about pretty much the same. I mean, this guy might die quicker. I don't want to be about to be four year old. So uh, I guess we'll just give it to him. But we still gotta figure out who we're gonna give King House to. There's no claimants to it whatsoever. I don't even know if there's uh who's the history. House Magnar. There's one living member apparently. Where is it? Uh, where's the one living member? <laughs> I'm not seeing it. Oh, is this guy? Let's see. This kid's dead. Huh. Yeah, this kid's dead. His wife's dead. He's not gonna have any more. No, I guess a good chance he could have a kid. But, I guess we'll give it to him. Just to not have to deal with it for now. Then again, I don't know. Religious differences are gonna play a, are gonna be a problem, I think. Let me see. It doesn't say religious differences. We're old gods, it's just they're beyond the wall gods. They're the same thing about culture. It says four and Brazilian and zero. But that's okay because we have a lot of people lined up for what we're going to give shit to. Uh, we have this Blackwood. I think this is the Blackwood that I played in the court. I think I was going to. I hope this is the Blackwood I was looking at. Yeah, I, I thought it was somebody else, but he's uh, married to Obella Sand, which is one of uh, Oberon's little bastard sand snakes. Uh, he's pretty well rounded. He's a scholar, and a school commander. Um, we're gonna invite him. I think that was the one. I kind of swore it was a different one. I thought it was this guy. Wasn't it? Yeah, it was this one. We invited him already. Yeah, so we're gonna give it, uh, Edmund Blackwood, we're gonna give him one of these things, we're gonna give, cause the Blackwoods used to be part of the North, that's why they're, uh, old gods, so we're gonna invite them up here, and we're gonna give them some, uh, land, uh, I think this guy would probably been better though, but, I don't know, it's not that big deal, he's got a son, I think that was why I did it too, so, when he gets here, we're gonna go ahead and give him some lands to take that off. Um, I'm trying to see who else. We gave, uh, gave Lawrence Snow, um, Hornwood. 
We didn't need a raise in the nobility because he was a uh, um, master of a house, so it wasn't like if we were king, we could have made like legitimacy, which I would have rather liked to have done, but that wasn't possible. Um, our heir is being um, educated in the Red Keep, which I don't like at all by some dude that has no friggin' you know, talent whatsoever and his education sucks. Um, I tried to educate him myself, it don't let me, but then when it comes down to it, he says no, or he says yeah, and then he ends up taking him right back. So, I mean, under me, he lets me do it, but it'll come to me for maybe like a, a week, and then he takes him back, so... Yeah, he's got him as a hostage pretty much. So we're pretty much looking at Rob here. Like Rob's pretty well rounded. A skilled fighter at ten. So we're kinda looking at him as maybe being our heir in case something happens to poor little Rhaegar. We named him after our brother that was slain at the Red Wedding. We also have our adopted son, Harwood Snow. Which he's pretty decent. He's got a ten marshal at thirteen. Uh, he's got a martial education. He's a wolf child, so he has extra health. He's just adopted, that's all. But we can legitimize him at any time. I guess you can really legitimize your own kids. Uh, we lose a little piety for it. We will. I mean, I guess if I did legitimize him, I would probably put him, I guess, maybe in front of Rhaegar. Rhaegar is only uh, 11 years old. I'm not sure if legitimized come after or not. So, but that's going to give us minus 50 with everybody. And then our wife, uh, our wife will, um, I think she does for like fucking 120 months or some shit like that. So it's a long time, but he's a pretty good kid. Uh, he loves us. We're friends, matter of fact. I forgot. So yeah, um, let's go ahead. We're gonna go ahead and wait for Rick on to come here, but we're gonna give these people some land now. So why did I want to get a thing? I thought it was this. See, I'm getting them all mixed up. Yeah, Edric. I guess I had him too. Maybe this is a backup. Alright, we're gonna give Edric Dustin, so we're gonna see if we can give Dustin. Some of these are gonna be commands too, so that's that. They're, they're cities. Um, we have King House. That's when it came in Japan. I'm not giving up the dreads for it. Uh, we have Weeping Bay, and we have East Milk. And we have Carl. So we have, uh, I think I'm gonna put a Blackwood up on one of these too, so. We have the Glover, and this dude's pretty good, so I might give him a push. Some of these are going to be commands, but, uh, let me see, Grunts, <laughs> Grunts, he's already a master of a city, I guess it's in, um, Deep Wood somewhere, yeah, so then I give it to him. Uh, Roger Griswell is 22. Probably give him something. Uh, we have the Flynn. He has two girls. We have a young wife. We got Baron Tar Tallheart. He's heir to the castle of Manvers. So maybe we can give him something around here. He's got decent stewardship. Uh, we have the Egg Edmund Black. Alright, yeah, that's the Black so then we get the black wood guy or something up here too so we're gonna go ahead and create uh the high lordship of car hold but we have to create it before we get the shit away or it won't let us do it so uh we'll go ahead and create that all right and then we're gonna give First, we're gonna wait until Rickon gets here. I don't want to give these two, and then they start asking for shit. So, same thing with uh, up here. 
we're gonna go ahead and create that and then we're gonna give it to the Driftwood Hall one. Alright, Driftwood Hall, we're gonna give you a High Lordship of Scoggins. We don't wanna put everything under it yet, so uh, let's go and give King House to, uh, we're gonna get the Dustin. We might do the Dustin. The Glover, I'm gonna give over in a car hold. Flint. Maybe we'll get we'll get the flint though, I think. Or this, that one dust or the one uh Glover is bamboo fucker, right? Give him one uh Edric. Yeah, we'll give Edric that one. So we'll give him King House. I give you the first king house. Alright, Lordship of King House. Is there anything on the new cover though? So you will become my Lord of King House. And then we're gonna give these guys the High Lordship of Skagri. But yeah, I should give it to a Skagri Seed. Alright, that gives that guy, I guess. So then we'll give it a high lord. What is there underneath of this that has me given up? I don't know why it's 80. Hold on, there has to be something else over here. Uh, Ranger's Refuge, Dreadfort, Children's Tower, Barbleton, East Harbor, Snowdell, yeah. yeah, I don't, I don't understand why it would be 80, extra 20. Let me see, is there anything? None of these have double things, so... I guess because he's under me right now. Yeah, okay. He's going to go with it. Alright. I understand now. That's probably why. Alright, um... Yeah, Grand Letter Title. High Lord Chicago. Something under. There. Now you're a High Lord. So he should be under him now. Okay. Alright, that makes good go so you like us a little more. Alright, and then we have to give out these. I already made the High Lord ship, alright? Yeah, alright. So we're gonna give the bomb ass Glover one of these. He's young. Let me see, is there anybody we can marry him to if we have 69 souls here? Young. Uh, She wouldn't be that bad, I guess. Damn, we're fucking. I wanted to keep her there. <laughs> Alright, we're gonna give him. Should, should we give him East Mount or Carl's Post or Ranger's Refuge? <laughs> Let me see, this one only has one, so does that one. This one, I don't even know how many men it can have all together because it's a new uh, administration. It's not gonna show. I think East Mount is the better of the two, if I'm not mistaken. Severe depopulation. <laughs> I bet, um, two years, yeah. I'm thinking of Weeping Bay, but I'm not sure. For some reason. Let me see, hold on. One's a large northern keep. Ones. They're both large northern cubes because they're pretty much the same. But I guess we'll give Weeping Bay to Glover. Uh, Gallon Glover. Yeah. Grant you land title. Give you Weeping Bay. You're now the Lord of Weeping Bay. I've been, I was picking people too that didn't have. Uh, they aren't heirs to anything. Because I don't want to get too powerful. Um, and I think the other black, this black boy that's going to be coming, we'll give him East Mount. Because he's got good stewardship. So, again, I'm pause for a second. We're going to take a little bit of a shot. My war Rob is inquisitive and asks so many questions that it's hard to answer them all. I try my best, and for every answer I give, Rob seems to like me even more. So, I've become friends with my other son. So, me and my two boys, 
Not her with me. I'm on my brace. Not my brace. Let me make sure I didn't that one fact. Still, so fucking get called in the war. <laughs> All right. Um. Yeah. Well, she's still trying to get Sansa in the north, but it shouldn't be a problem. Uh, we do have a couple seeds in Godswood now. This Godswood. I have to put a um some kind of friggin' priest or something. Uh, let's see. We put a uh, sell it. So Zealous and my religion. Oh my fellas do who will come to court first. Alright, um let's see. Try to go with my good. This guy Jeez, he's fucking good. Uh we'll go ahead and bring him to court and we'll give him that God's wood. Then we have uh, the two cities, which you can pretty much give to whoever's left. Or well, I'll take care of those last. Uh, wait, another B. You know, some like super, super good, I guess. Oh, we're we're allowed to pay for the education. We won't be able to pick the fucking shit. Man. This is the part that pisses me off. I wonder if I went back to his guardian to be able to pick it. Just for the, the little bit. Let's see, uh, Harlan. We'll take Harlan on somebody else real quick. Uh, I want to be a clansman. <laughs> He's famous, so. Uh, she's my counselor, though, so I don't want her to get pissed. Cause of it. I just want to have him for right now. Just for. You know, yeah. There, and then he'll let me be his guardian, even though it won't last. But maybe it'll. I hope. Nah, shit, it ain't gonna work because I didn't. If I did it before, damn it. If I did it before, I probably could have. We're never gonna pay for good education. Maybe uh, I accept your gracious invitation. Okay, so can I pick his? Damn it, he did it already. Okay, uh, it doesn't matter. He's gonna take him back anyways. Accept gracious invitation. This is the guy. Right, this is the guy we're gonna give the gods would to. Uh, and we got Rick on. Okay, so we're gonna give you. Gods with a snow bell. Yeah, alright. There you go, brother. Alright, uh, what happened? Galbert died. Natural death. Alright, we got little Ricky. Little Ricky. Uh, what is this guy? Oh shit. Alright, yeah, that guy earlier. I right, will. He'll sit there. Alright, so. We got Rick on. We're gonna get Rick on married first. We don't wanna marry some like 50 year old woman. Uh. Let's see. Old gods first. Oh, just too much to pick from. I don't wanna give somebody too young either. Cause he needs to have heirs. Like. Sooner the better. There's not really any. See, a lot of <laughs> northern men and old god people got killed. Uh, I guess we can give somebody that's like four years off. She's not heir, right? Uh, I think it's 11 year old. Mira. She's all at the bottom, so. That'd probably be the best one. Man, he's gonna take a prestige hit, though. Shit. Uh. 
This just seems available even in the shape of seven. Alright. Is there anyone of age to be married right now? That isn't damn near menopause age. Uh, see, I hate doing this stuff on camera, but it's necessary. Plus, you get to see like what happens, who, why, and how I pick. Oh, we're gonna so, uh, Valerian. Oh my God, she would hate him. Uh huh. If she hates me that much. Definitely won't hate him. Blase, whoever that is. Uh, Drox. That would not be bad. I wonder how much of a hit he takes. Oh, she's the heir. God damn it. Of course. Hey, he's always too good to be true. Uh, <clears throat> I definitely don't want that. I assume he'd be in uh, Blood Feud 2 being a Stark. Uh, I think we might have to go back to that Flint that's 11. I oh, got this 11 year old Zoe. Of course she's the heir. Never works out. Uh, 11 year old Morgan. And she's quick. I think we're just gonna go old gods with this. Um, that way he's not taking too much of a hit. Or the Dane. Oh, she's the lady of. <laughs> Never mind. Alright, uh, Harding. I think this is, uh,. This might be what's her name's kid. No, it's not. I think we'll just do old gods, man. Nothing's gonna pop up really. Oh, who would this get us with? Garland. I think Garland's the heir, right? Yeah, we're gonna do that one. Fuck, she's the heir. Of course we'll do it, but he's not gonna he's not gonna keep it. Hold on, is his wife pregnant or anything? Damn, and she's barely aged to even have any more kids. We're just gonna have to give Rickon the, the flank girl, I guess. It'd be great to get this one, but she won't accept it when it's time. Uh, okay. Let's look real quick. The box. These are all uh, girls that have shit already. That's my daughter, yeah. That wouldn't work out too good. <laughs> Alright, uh. We yeah, have a bracket, but she's too young, man. She's probably heir, too, of course. Zoe's heir, Rowan's heir. There's a Reed, but she's a little too young. I guess it's gonna have to be the Flint here. You're gonna have to take a prestige hit, buddy. Alright, and we'll go ahead and wait till he. Are they okay? It. I gotta pick a new advisor. Oh, hold on. We might use Recon. Let me see. We'll, we'll wait a minute. We'll go ahead and get him. The Lords and Iron Throne have approved the institution of attack ship and noble obligation. Great. It's voted due to returning a favor of Lord Luthor. I didn't owe nobody a favor. He owes me a favor. I don't understand that shit sometimes. It never what works. Uh, Alright, so now Rickon's wife's well, betrothed. Shit. I wasn't even thinking. He's the, it's gonna go away when I send him over there. Fucker. And I want him to have Carl. I'm just gonna give it to him. He can make his own choice later. Then we give him Carl hold. And then, I guess, we'll give him Carhold first, and then the High Lord. What's up? Uh, the, uh, I guess the fucking, whatever it's called, this God's Wood Snowdell. And the other one. I guess I gotta let him do that. But no, matter of fact, I'm gonna do it. Something's in my fucking nuts. Alright, uh. We have East Mount to give out still. And we're going to give that to the Blackwood, right? Yeah. So, we'll give him East Mount. Okay, you got East Mount. Now you're back in the north of the Blackwood. Alright, uh. We gave that one clever one already. 
So we have car hold, we have the dread fort. We're gonna keep the dread fort. Probably gonna keep the uh what's it called? The new Kalen stuff too. So East Harbor and Barbleton is what we need. So we have Markor Flint. Roderick Riswell. Harrion. Gallon we already gave some to Edric we did. We have Cregan, Dustin, uh, Markor. Uh, we'll give it to this guy. One of those cities. Yeah, Barbleton. And then we'll give uh, Tallheart, we'll be getting Manvers. But it's got decent um, stewardship. How about Cregan, Edric, oh, Cregan, doesn't have really good. Gallon is good. Right. We'll give it to this Rizlo. He's not going to get anything, anyways, I don't think. Project. Yeah, he's far enough down. Now we're getting the city of East Harbor. So, that's all we have is to give Rickon car hold, and then we'll be cool with the other ones for now. Alright, so I'll give Rickon car hold, and it's probably going to break the trouble, so. Lordship of car hold. Alright. I didn't break it yet, we'll see. Oh, he's kept to it. Alright, so I'm gonna give him the high lordship of Park. That's everything under. So I'll get these two with it. High lordship of cargo, there you go, little bro. Or little cousin, that is. So he's gonna love us for a little while. At least good 10 years. <laughs> Alright, he hasn't broke the betrothal, it doesn't look like. So, we're okay with that. Now, we'll go ahead and pick a advisor. I guess we'd have to give it to him. I don't know. He'd probably become uh, one of my more powerful ones. So you know these ones are going to want a position. Which I'll probably give it to him. Next time I get something up. Rickon, I'll give it to him. He's fairly young. So, um. See, but I don't really like that guy. I don't really like him either, so. Mmm. <laughs> Hard choice to make. I mean, he'll like me for a lot longer, but he's got that title claimant thing, too. I'll we'll use this guy. Braincore. Braincore Lake. I mean, Willis acting like a complete asshole, so I'm not giving him shit. Alright, so I gotta give it to you. Now we just need to get, uh... Go ahead and drop these guys down. I have to the music. Okay, Lord Paramount John, the Robins of the State of War. Where are you at war right now? Iron Throne, Weeping Town, the Jor War over Weeping Town. Fuck is Weeping Town, anyways? Uh, it's this little fucking. Are you really going to call me in for a thousand men? Why did the music stop? Let me check this real quick. Uh, game options, audio. Like low and really drastic, like something. All right, 
Lord Paramount John, the realm of the state of war, so yes, we will defend our lead. I will not concern myself even now. Uh, the rebels call me just. We're definitely not going to. Now it's time to break free. Man, he even lost more men. I guess because I'm not part of it. Um, what did the Reach do? Did the Reach do it? Let's check it out. All the good dudes. Uh, Garland. Yeah, he's actually part of it. No, it's Mace. So Mace joined. I guess we'll just, you know, look like we're playing. It should be over, like, rather quickly. Whatever. But we're not gonna do anything. Uh, we gotta wait for this guy to get down here so we can drop on him. We'll let these uh, vassal levies race too long repair themselves before we start uh, doing any kind of warring. Um, these guys here are just gonna leave because they don't cost anything really. I'm dropping the army, I don't know why. I guess we can placate him with flattery because I'm not giving him any tax concessions. Damn sure I'm not giving him gold. So we'll just placate him. Uh look at that supply limit, isn't that great? 100 man. Son of the wolf. Hmm. Sometime now you have heard people at court gossiping about your son Harwood. There are conversations that stop as you enter the room, words spoken in hushed voices behind your back, furtive glances as you walk by. With time, you have managed to deduce certain things. Harwood seems to generally be subject of either curiosity, fear, envy, or a combination of any of the three. The word that you most often hear repeated as you eavesdrop on gossips is wolf. Indeed, just the other day you heard someone speak a rumor that you'd heard several times before that his real mother was a wolf. I'm glad they call you my son of wolf. Alright. Yeah, we, we approve. I must put a stop to this talk. No. We're gonna love our kid no matter if he is the son of a wolf. He's our adopted son. Alright, we need to start building stuff in Winterfell, but we're gonna wait till this harsh winter is over. Oh shit, we're so much more. Alright, good news, my co conspirator, Prince Redon of Winterwood, has levied a lady Danella, a dread for it, will soon have a tragic fall off the castle parapets. I forgot all about that. We have a, a plot to kill a little Danella, and then we'll get the High Lord ship of the dread for which I think we'll keep to give to one of our sons unless little Bran comes back from the dead yep so hopefully this will work if it doesn't it's a problem because it's got a 240% pop now alright let's see if there anybody can add to it real quick wow 28% there's a lot of people that don't want this girl to live let's see 23%. Uh, oh, 183. That would be great. But of course not. Uh, let's go get that one last one. It's only going to cost 15 gold anyway. It might not get to be on this yet. Probably. But. Okay. Prince Rickon of Winterwood. He's got good entry. Let's see if it adds to it. He's on it. Let's see if he gets it before it. Alright, pop. Whoa, it went down. Okay. Uh, yeah, our wife's pregnant again. That's great. Alright, uh, Ramsey's no longer regent. I guess that's from. Uh, has inherited the high lordship. Seems little Danella is dread for it. Not yet learned to fly. She died a quick, mysterious, plainful death. Chicken for lunch today? I think so. 
Jeez, they went all the way up to 903%. How'd that happen? I think one of these is the, the fucking Master Whispers. I don't know. Alright, so we've got rid of the bolts. So the Dread Fort is ours. High Lord ship and all. So the Boltons are completely gone. We have got rid of them. Now, John doesn't seem a sadistic little fucker or anything, but there's a shitload of frays in the world. 68. There's no way we'd be able to kill them all. <laughs> so, I think we'll have to wait for another day for that. It sucks that we can't just outright declare war on um, the uh, phrase. See, they have no heir or that Orland guy. He's never going to have kids. I wonder if maybe we should try to take the trident for Rickon on these days. But only if we're king, I think. Because it isn't going to do anything for us. Why is she not under me? Maybe she was under uh, them or something. Uh, well, she'll take our vassalization. Is there any other freaking part of the north that's not? No. Alright. Gotta head away. Money lenders are here. Of course, I gotta pay some miles of debt. Mm. They'll have their gold. Huh. That's not my debt. So I should still be able to get a loan, right? No. I guess I'll just pay it. I got the money. Yeah. Okay. She accepts. Torn squares on there, so. Damn. Hold on. Ah, that's right. She had the ether. Ether. So we gotta find somebody for that. Uh. Shit. Maybe I'll get the hand at least so close. Ether's right there. He's only the heir to the man of verse one. He's young, she's young. Oh yeah, let's give it to him. Unless there's anybody else. Let's see their court right now. Yeah, hostage. Oh, do you know? These are all, they're all bastards. I guess I could raise them in ability, but... Demon dance for me, no. What about little Owen? Oh. Maybe he's an orphan now. I mean, why not? Nah, no, I wouldn't be too good of a roller if I'm just giving up shit to little kids. There's Bayon, but he doesn't have any stewardship. And he's beyond the wall, but still, we can't do anything about his heritage now. We should have done that earlier. I need a sympathizer for Westeros. He got some that's a plus. All right, yeah, we'll just get let's get the fucking bear and get rid of it. Uh, anything under it? No. There, you're now the Lord of Ether. Do me proud. I probably want the high lordship though. I mean, they're gonna get it. I know he's gonna ask for it, but we have high diplomacy, so we can just placate him. Um, one of my daughters there. She needs educator. This is their stewardship. So, I know her mom's good with the diplomacy. Is she good diplomacy? Not really. Uh, let's see how hot uh, he's pretty good. He's okay with his fucking education plays. Of Varys. See, she might be turned to a Lysini. <laughs> I think because he's my court tier, though, she might not. This guy's pretty well rounded, too. Let's see what it says. It doesn't say she turned into Lysini. So let's have Varys. If she turns something, then we can always uh, change her shit. 
uh, Lady Leon over here now. She's got a marsh with Marshall. Uh, how do we go? We got Harwood. That's right, we took off Rob. Alright, we need to put back on Rob. I mean, not really going Rob. Oh, it says we're on Rob. Oh, uh, Harwood it was. Alright, let's go ahead and go back to Harwood. And then we'll give uh, her the guy that I gave to Harwood. I think it was Morgan, wasn't it? I don't want her to turn to a clansman. <laughs> I guess we can get Mage. Mage doesn't have good. She's a poor scholar, man. What the fuck? Uh, Artemis isn't bad. Tuttle, but he's a face at seven. Uh, I should turn into a Kragnog. <laughs> Is that Walder water? No, that can't be. That's the other the artist. There, all my kids are educated. Alright, so we're gonna end this here. Um, next time we get back, I'll see how our bastard's going down pretty much you now. So when we get back, uh, maybe we'll try to start some shit. So, <laughs> until then, it's last earth later.